today it's all about sharing savory and cozy fall dinner ideas for this autumn season here at my home on the northern plains of Iowa. I'll be making a charcuterie board filled with a variety of meats, cheeses, and dried fruits perfect for an autumn afternoon. And next I'm going to make creamy and hearty pumpkin macaroni and cheese. So as always, I'm so glad you've stopped by for a visit here at my home the carriage house. So I have this cute little ceramic pumpkin bowl and I like to put some type of marmalade or jam in the center. And I saw this fig and walnut butter at a general store when I was in town the other day and thought it would be perfect for this charcuterie. And this is perfect to make if you have guests coming over this fall, maybe serve a few hours before you make dinner. So I'm going to put these beautiful red grapes on the plate and then I'm making prosciutto and provolone roll-ups. So now that that's done, I'm going to move on to adding chorizo to the charcuterie. I love chorizo. It's a spicy, flavorful sausage that has a combination of meaty, smoky, and tangy notes. And the spice comes from hot pepper seasonings like vinegar and chili peppers in Mexican chorizo or paprika in Spanish chorizo.
So now I'm adding sweet medjool dates to this plate. I love dates and they're actually really good for you. They help stimulate the immune system, reduce inflammation, and all kinds of things. Then I have sweet cinnamon almonds that I'm going to use as well. But it's really good just to get in the kitchen, get creative, use what you already have on hand first, and then you sort of venture out and go to the store and get what you really need. But I really love this time of year. I love to try and make our home warm and inviting as much as I can by lighting candles or even having a mini type um, of charcuterie out on a plate in the kitchen on a late autumn afternoon. pumpkin macaroni and cheese is a perfect fall recipe for a chilly autumn evening this is the pioneer woman's recipe which i will leave down below but it's so delicious and it is pure comfort food and i have three different cheeses that i'm using i'm using fontina smoked gouda and parmesan and this is so easy to make and it's great for leftovers too so gonna take a minute to grate my cheeses and then i'll move on to chopping fresh garlic Also too, you can get this exact knife set that I have here that I absolutely love. It's from Knife Saga, which I love the name by the way, but I'm really loving the light pink color. It's just something different, but they do have other colors available and it comes with a variety of knives, a chef's knife, kitchen shears, a sharpener, a paring knife, and much more. And these are outstanding. They cut very smoothly and I love the handles and how they feel when I'm cutting up vegetables or smashing garlic but Knife Saga is going to randomly select three lucky winners from the comment section and you'll receive your own special chef's knife from them so that'll be fun and definitely leave a comment but if you are interested in purchasing these knives whether it's for you or as a special gift then I will leave all of their information down below. So chopping about three cloves of garlic right now and I like to add a bit of kosher salt to my garlic when chopping because it acts as an abrasive to, bra uh, to break down the garlic and draw out moisture. So just a little kitchen tip for you. I'm going to finish up with the garlic and then I'll be moving on to the bread crumb topping for this creamy and delectable macaroni and cheese. Thank you. 
the topping is done, I'm going to start making the sauce and going to add so much goodness to it like sage leaves, nutmeg, ground mustard, and so much more. So if you want, go ahead and grab a cup of tea or coffee and we'll finish making this meal together. much for stopping by today. I hope you end up making or sharing these delicious recipes for the autumn charcuterie board and the creamy pumpkin mac and cheese. You can always subscribe and become part of our slow living circle, homemaker circle, where we cherish the simple pleasures in this journey we call life. Wishing you well and stay safe, my sweet friend. Bye. <laughs>